qualifying for the 2024 Le Mans 24 hours. 60 minutes on track, 63 cars oh, all trying to set the their aspect. fastest time and a real log jam just to leave the pit lane. Key here, the top eight all go through into Hyperpole on Thursday and the top of the pile in LMGT3, the number 77 Proton Competition Mustang. Fastest of all in the LMP2 category, Cool Racing's Orica with its Gibson engine and in the attention-grabbing hypercar class, disappointment for Brendan Hartley and his teammates in the number eight Toyota. Three different fast runs, all interrupted by traffic and finally, by driver error causing a spin and ruining another set of tyres. They did not make it through into the top eight. 63 Lamborghini also with dramas for Mirko Bortolotti. They failed to make it through into the top eight as well. They would end up 14th place on the grid. Just missing out, the Spa winners, the number 12 car from Hertz Team Jota Calamilet, ninth fastest, that's where they will start. Neither of the Peugeots made it through either for their home race. They will have to work hard from further down the grid and hope to avoid trouble at the start of the race. For Ferrari though, both car number 50 and last year's winners, 51, made it through into the Hyperpole category. But for Cadillac, two of their three cars also made it through. Hometown hero Sebastian Bourdais, second fastest. Could he be on pole at his home race? It's entirely possible. The top eight will go in the Hyperpole and that will decide the eight places at the front of the grid. Fastest so far though, Dries Van Tor in the number 15 BMW run by the Belgian WRT team. And there was drama right at the end of the session from the man who is so often the fastest in qualifying Toyota's Kamui Kobayashi. Too much kerb in the Porsche curves and he spun into the gravel, bringing out the red flag a couple of minutes from the end of the session. Delight in the WRT garage, they were the fastest car in qualifying and have a great chance of perhaps starting on pole, but Toyota, the number seven car, will start on the last row of the grid.